Hey guys, we're back again. Welcome Hi back guys. to our channel, our familia, our chisme, our triunfos, nuestras derrotas. Estamos las lonjotas, ¿cómo están? Bueno, hablando de lonjotas, bueno, lonjitas, porque pues yo tengo grandes y si existen por ahí. Tenemos que ir al gym. Yo me las escondo, no tengo chichis. Pero aquí la señorita no tiene zapatos. ¿Saben por qué? ¿Saben por qué? Porque me robé sus zapatos de guerra. Right? Yeah, guys, he uses my shoes to go to the gym, which they're my shoes. It, he has shoes. It's, tiene okay. zapatos, no más que, I don't know why, he likes to use my shoes. Okay, it's because hers están, son más chicos and they feel like tighter on my foot. So when I'm running, they don't feel all loose. Um, but yeah, so I kind of try to so basically we're here at the store we're trying to find running shoes actually more running shoes than any other type of shoes um so we're trying different stores different malls different outlets but first we came to i don't know if you guys can see it it's uh it's right there whiz a wise whatever you want to call that there's no i in the no? name it's just W S S. No, um, there's. It's. Whoosh, whoosh. There's no I. Oh, yes. there's. Oh, never mind. We're coming to. Whoosh. Yeah, so it's like a shoe store, uh, but anyways. Yeah. So hopefully we find good shoe. She's over here, me mugging people in the parking <laughs> lot that are walking by because we're trying to record. But yeah, so stay tuned. Expensive feelers I've ever seen. <laughs> They're sick, though. Don't get me wrong. I need a rebel. Do you think they sell rebel here? I don't know. You need a coffee? A coffee? Yeah. I think just because we're still in the car and we can like. So, where we at, babe? We at Little Caesars. Little seasons in front of a cure. I got so tired all of a sudden. Look at it. My Why eyes. are you crying? Porque estoy cansado. Just kidding. And you're filming so much. That makes it look so awkward. Okay. La chota. La chota cops. <laughs> How's it going, bud? Let me do a pepperoni pizza. Yeah. Yep. Cool. We were telling you guys that we went to go look for shoes for me we went to like three four different stores and why are you them. lying <laughs> why is he lying we why does one... he have to lie <laughs> i'm not even lying these shoes were for me i know we went to one um we couldn't find them and i'm mad because i want the shoes why don't you look for them on amazon i'm gonna look for them online but it's not the same i wanted to say i got shoes well, shoes for days so if you buy them on amazon you won't get the shoes 
I'm gonna be able to say I got shoes, yeah. but not like that. So now we're on our way to my cuñada's house, which is test, and um, we're taking them pizza. And Even we had Texas Row House. Shout out to Texas Row House. Why you gotta be? <gasps> Look, you guys, how pretty that looks. I don't know if you guys could see it, but. Can. When people think Arizona is a desert, but it's not. It's really pretty. Hmm. Um, but I'm sick. <coughs> I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, I am sick. I have an ear infection, guys, and it hurts really bad. I can't put headphones on or anything on. Earphones, nothing. Headsets, nothing. It's it's infected. I hope you feel better yeah. tomorrow. I will be better tomorrow because I took medication. Anyways. Well, we're going to Destiny House because we're going to go chill over there for a little bit. For two hours, maybe. Or until 8 p.m. <laughs> Just kidding. Until we, we go and we want to come back. So, how's everybody's day going? So, guess what? Me? Oh, we I have 34 subscribers now. <gasps> What? 34. That's and we awesome. only had two. We only had like 15, huh? If that. Starting. 15 yeah. subscribers. Now we have 34. Instead, subscribe and watch our videos. Even though we don't post a lot, but we're trying our best to do so. Yeah. Um, we try not to delete them for you guys. Trust me. Yes. <laughs> Teníamos un video tan suave and it got deleted by got accident. Deleted by it was awesome guys it was gonna be an awesome challenge and it was funny we tried our best to make it funny it was actually really funny it was funny it was really funny but we're gonna bring more challenges more vlogs um yeah right babe we are good things bigger things things with cameras and macbooks one day he wants to buy a MacBook, which I'm saying it's okay, but we have to wait a little bit long I'm more. I'm trying to Mac a book, girl. What's up? Like, what's up with your letters and your your rulings and your first edition book? I'll be like, what's good? Let me see them pages. Anyways, um, so yeah, so we'll probably be vlogging more. I want to do more, um, like I actually want to do a mukbang. Agando. <laughs> Tragando con nosotros. ¿Cómo está? <laughs> Eduardo has a confession to make. Él ve a un YouTuber que, que es, es un, un su muchacho. So right now we're just driving, 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 driving. I guess at this point we can just say it's for our kids. So hey kids, we're driving to your tia Destiny's house. So me and Edward, we want to make our family grow, huh? We want to have our own kids. Yeah. We want to have We don't want to be family. like taking kids again from like random places. <laughs> we want to have a little family, basically. Soon, Soon, we're trying our best. I can't tell if it's him or not, but I like right now when he was closer, it kind of looked like him. That's why I brought it up, because I was like, wait. What do you see? Don't see that. I don't think, think it is. So. No, the lights look different. It's too much coincidence. So yeah, we're trying. Queremos niños, queremos babies. Queremos que nuestra... No, dos babies, no más. Those babies. He's crazy. He could have them himself if he wants them. Anyways. Well, I'm 24. He's 25. She's 25 too. She's I about to be 25, 25 in like in two November. months. Trying to look like I robbed you. Tan joven, tu inocencia. Yeah, Aha. I was little. I was a young girl that didn't know anything about love until you came to my life. Anyways. I came um, into her life. I did come into her life. So yeah. Technically, um, you came into my life though. I, of course I came into your life. There you go. For better. For better, for worse. Yeah. Hashtag goals. Hope you guys are doing good. Espero que se la están pasando bonito este fin de semana, este sabadito. Um, yeah. Do you have anything to say? 
like, share, subscribe, comment. Um, Except you, Junior. Stop commenting <laughs> on our stuff. Just he kidding. Does. We love you, buddy. Incoming message from the big giant head. Sus chares. Sus chares. Por vernos, por tomar su volver, tiempo. Volver. Volver. Por vernos. Um, se los agradecemos de todo corazón. What? Stay tuned for a new episode coming next week. Yeah, we're going to. We'll have a challenge for next week. We promise. Yeah, we will have a challenge, guys. I hate runabouts, guys. I hate them. I don't know why she hates them. I hate these things. Can't stand them. I cannot drive through these. They're so confusing to me. Watch out. No, this was fine though. This was where it was going though. Is it? No, it wasn't. It is. We're going to Christian's house, right? Yeah. No, we're going through the other. We're going like if we're going to my compadre's house. See, guys, I hate these. I hate them. Can't stand runabout. Oh, like if if I could go uh, the longest way ever to avoid it, I would avoid a runabout. I can't. She would. I if can't. She, if she has to, if, she, if it would add 20 minutes to a route. Just to avoid a roundabout, she'll add those 20 minutes instead of she getting there sooner. Oh, what's that, Benton? Ah, chido, tres el omnitrix. Anyways. My compadre so, Oh, yeah? yeah? Literally in that corner. I don't know why. I'm just asking como asco. Me too. I think the smell of the pizza, maybe. Because we're full. And we smell more food and we're like, ah, oh, I don't know. I feel dizzy now. Our Anyways, sick? yeah, probably. Because we've been driving a lot, just Maybe. turning and stuff. Cool. So yeah, guys. So stay tuned. Keep watching Another us. Share about. us. Another runabout. But this is a small one. I could control this one. I can control. But the last one we passed, no. So, díganos, pónganos ahí un comentario, díganos, queremos que hablen de esto, una experiencias que experiencias que han tenido como pareja, a lo mejor, I don't know. Yeah. Um, sure. Just tell us, guys. Tell Let us. us know. Let us know what you guys want us to be talking about in our well, vlogs or doing or going places, maybe. Where we go. But yeah, uh, we're here. We're, I think. Yes. Yeah, we're oh. here, guys, at Destiny's. Stay tuned. Ahora para acabar, vamos a comer. So, para terminar el día y la noche. Look guys, it's fruta con nieve y granola. Mine's healthier. I have yogurt. Same one. Yogurt. Because we're healthy. Ish. Because we're trying to be healthy, guys. Para contestar preguntas, um, it's como un challenge. It's like um, like do we be kind of like do we belong together challenge. Um, and it's just questions online that we found so it'll be cool to know what that says right it's not going to determine si de verdad nos queremos o no pero son puras preguntas que la gente se hace y es una, una, encue una encuesta mm -hmm. una encuesta una encuesta sí. it's like everything's in season I think I don't know the strawberries are sweet not sour. Ooh, piña. Mm. Okay. So, el, so basically, the question is, are we meant to be together? As me and him, of course, right? Um, and it's mm. like a quiz, basically, that we're taking. Um, so basically, we're going to start. And then we're gonna start eating too, so. Oh. So, si estamos comiendo con la boca llena, I'm sorry. Ya estaba comiendo. <laughs> mm. Is it good? It's good. It's calm. Te dije. Estaba bueno. Mira. Okay. So, mm. first question How long have you known each other? Mmm. I want to say how long do we know each other eight, eight to nine years think about it yeah it was like bef 
it was like 2011 mm -hmm. when we started talking. Mm -hmm. 2011. That was mm -hmm. beginning of 2011. 2011 was our when we started dating. Yeah. I remember because I made sure of it because it was gonna make it easy <laughs> for me to remember the the day. Mhm. Mm no, but it really ended up being that day. It was kind of a coincidence. So. Yeah, and we met. Well, that's a whole another story. Mm. Pero si llevamos conociéndonos, que es la primera pregunta, más de ocho años, mm -hmm. más de ocho años. So that would be many years. Okay. You could read the next question if you want. Question number two. Do you share many of the same interests and hobbies? Um, uh, pregunta. Dice, si compartimos los mismos intereses o tal vez las mismas actividades? Um, same interests. I mean... No we, creo, to be honest. You don't think we have like... No creo que compartimos las mismas actividades o uh, intereses. Inter o uh -huh. que nos interesan las mismas actividades. I don't think so. Why? Because you don't like baseball, and I do. Yeah, sure. You're like more football. into football. I love football. Player. I'm more into baseball, softball. You're into football. Okay. I don't like basketball. Do you like basketball? Nah. Like, I'll watch I, it. Like, like, it's not one of my things to mm. go for. Like, yeah, of course, if it's free tickets, why not? Mm. Right? But it's not something that I want to, like, I'll get into. Soccer, I have to be into it, too. Mm-hmm. But... I have to want to see that actual match. But, yeah. but we're, I feel like it's more like that. Like, he's more into that type of sports. To football, right? Yeah. But see, you're, it's just one thing. Now, we both like Mexican music. We both like to sing, even though we're not, like, the super best but at it. Things. Mm. We like to eat. We like food. That's not how bad. Um, we like the same music. I feel we share the same ideas in a way. Mm -hmm. Compartimos mismas ideas. I I say we can't. We have yeah, very good. No. We have very good. We do have a lot of things in common. <clears throat> and we all but have we have a lot, a lot of, of things, things not in that common we don't agree with. Or not so much not agree, but we just we, we know the other one doesn't really like like mm -hmm. me. I I love to nerd out. I I, I I'm oh, a geek. I like cherry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And. I nerd out sometimes. Yeah, uh, you know I like comic books. Um, I like stuff like that. She doesn't like at all. Like she'll see it with me sometimes, so, or some sometimes something will catch her attention, or I'll tell her like us like oh, and I'll be like all into it, and I know she's just like paying attention to me because she like like kind of has to. to. <laughs> but you know, and then there's other things where she's like like certain like she she likes watching a lot of like YouTubers. Which I like it too, but she is really into it. Like me, I can miss a few episodes and stuff, and I'll catch up later or something. But it's mm -hmm. not like, but her, she's like, oh, look, there's a new video, and we're let's watch it. And I'm like, uh, okay, some old. I really like some other videos because I, I follow on too with her, but but she's more into it than me at this point. Mhm. Mm and let's not forget the biggest hobby we have: YouTube. And we both like it. So, says, what are the answers we can choose? Um, yes, we like a lot of the same things. We have a few shared interests, yes. We don't really know each other well enough to be sure yet. Maybe a couple. No, we're, by, we're opposites. Mm. I would just say, yes, we have a few shared interests, yes. Yeah, number two. Okay, next question. Number three, the object of your affection asks you out for dinner, but you already made plans with friends. How do you react? What are the answers? First answer, cancel your friends. They'll understand. Mention that you have plans, but immediately set an alternate date. Say thanks, but you can't make it. Ask if he or she wants to join you and your friends is set. So just having lunch together that day, that day instead or a late night coffee date. So if we're talking about me and you, 
Oh, when it comes to me and you, to be honest, I also tell you if you want to join us. Yeah, that that's actually more. So um, I think it's more like I wouldn't cancel unless they don't want you to join. Or it was like more like a girls' night out kind if, of thing. Yeah, so it depends. Same thing like if we meet. So in this like, case, is this the object of your affection asks you out for dinner, but you're here made friends with your friends, so it's dinner. Hmm. So in this, <laughs> so in this case, I want to say, I'm. I will. I, I I say I would ask you if you want to join us. Huh? Instead, and if then you say no because I want it to be just me and you, but like, well, I'm sorry. Maybe we could do it for tomorrow. Yeah. Or next day. Or, or the next weekend. Yeah. Or depending on or friends. depending on the plans with your friends too. Because if it's just something like come over and let's see what we do. That's yeah. not really like full on plans. So then, you know, so I, like me, plans, it depends yeah. on the plans with the friends. Because that I means sometimes it might be something really important with your friends. Mm-hmm. Like maybe your friends like gonna propose to his date. Oh yeah. Or maybe something like that. And then obviously at and that point you're like committed. Like a, but if it's just like, like a girls' night out too, like they said no guys, then of course I'm not gonna mm-hmm. bring you along. Of course. And if I already made plans with them, mm, then um, I'm gonna go with them, right? Mm-hmm. So. Or we can meet up for coffee later on at the night. Ya cuando te den pea. Ya se yo te digo, te suelo los pies y te digo, ¿cómo te fue en el club, mi amor? And you're asking me for a date now that you're gonna marry me. Um, We've been married. Ask <laughs> things, but you can't make it. Ask if he or she wants to join. I would say that one would be the he, best one. Yeah, that would actually be the first thing I would do. Mm-hmm. It, like, majority of the time okay. is that. Four. Numero cuatro. Do you laugh a lot with this person? Si nos reímos juntos. Es lo que hice la pregunta. Because you said, man, y yo me tío peo. I'll leave it at that. If, the, if that doesn't explain that we are nonstop laughing. We like, laugh. We laugh the at the stupidest things. And, both of, and we know it's like. Like, the dumbest things that we laugh, and it, I think that's, like, the big thing of a relationship, is mm-hmm. how we always just say laughing. Because we could be pissed off at each other, or had just an argument, and be, ne- like, next to each other. And then something happens, or something pops up, or we do something. The other person, no matter how mad they're at, they start, they break a smile. And as soon as one of us breaks a smile, the other one was like, okay, and like, hey, hey. And then we poke at it, and we're like, alright, I'm sorry, like, the fight was stupid, and that shit was hilarious. And yeah. But yeah, no, we 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 laugh nonstop. It's rare that we don't laugh. When we don't laugh, it's either we're sick, hangry, or tenemos hambre. I know it's the same, but that happens more often. So it would be yes, and we have a lot of, lots of inside jokes together. Mm-hmm. Because que cool. Yeah. Ponerse y a ver qué pasa. Okay. <laughs> Cinco. How do you feel when you think about introducing this person to your family? I feel positive all the time. Me too. I really want like, to. I mean, my let's say from the first, first time that I had to bring you to my family, I feel like I felt pretty sure of what I was doing, to be honest. Mm. What do you, how did you feel? Be honest. Mm. I was nervous. But I was really proud too because I really liked who I was with. And I really wanted my family to see who I fell in love with. Um, but, yeah, no, I really wanted them to see it because, to me, family's a big thing. And it's mm-hmm. not, my family's not really that big. She knows this. Her family's huge. My family, from what is my family, we're small. Like, especially here here in the U.S. They're really small for me. Mm-hmm. Who would I consider my family? Um, in Mexico, that's another thing. And that's the family que quiero que conozca. Porque... Carrilludos, carrilleros, mm, no sé cómo más le hicieran, uh, car- te sacan carrilla a todo. And you have to take it, that's the thing. Because the day, the day they see that your butt hurts you, oh, it's gonna get worse. So don't take it up the ass. That's like that's what I always tell myself, and like, when like, or people tell me, damn, like the family, like, I'm like, don't take it up the ass. That's how my family is. And, we love each other. We like we'll laugh at each other in our face, and that shows that we love each other because mm-hmm. we're not talking smack like oh mira esto acá. But no, yeah, I really, I I feel confident, and I really want to meet the rest of my family soon. That's another story too. <laughs> yeah, pretty soon, hopefully. Yeah. So you'll get it. So I want to say I feel positive. I think they'll get along well. Mm. They they they've already met and it went really well. 
they were already met. So no, it's, I feel positive and they're they're along, right? Well, they already met and they went really good. Where is it? And really well, number three. Oh yeah. Or four, four, yeah. Okay, four. number six. Do the two of you have similar feelings about religion, morals, and or values? <sighs> so, numero seis, pregunta. Esta, esta es la pregunta. Okay. Entre, ver, lo, entre, los, maestro, entre o sea. los dos tienen similidades en las formas de que se sienten por una religión a uh, morales o también lo que viene siendo pues, how do you say values? Pues, morales es lo mismo values and morals en inglés en inglés es lo mismo morales um, y pues um, ¿qué es lo más importante para ti? como quien dice si tenemos las mismas cosas que pero que viene siendo religión, morales y que que va que um, y qué es lo que nos Valor, importa, que, a qué eh, valoramos la, más, uh -huh. ajá. Si tenemos eso similar o compartimos eso no. En which we compartimos lo mismo. And I'll be honest, I want to say que sí. Up to maybe 90%. To be honest, I feel like no. <laughs> at all. Mm -mm. Really at all? Wow. When it comes to to religion, yeah. When it comes to religion, I feel like we don't. When it comes to morals, I feel like we probably do. And when it comes to value, I feel like we don't. Why? Because I feel like when it comes to religion, yeah. we both know different and we both believe different. Even though I feel like we want to be in the same, we do. And the we do. same thing, but I feel like it's hard. And that's actually one of our biggest obstacles we have as a relationship yeah. or as a couple. But, I mean, it's not something that's going to, you know, fully... It can, though. It can. It can mess with, with your relationship. So, if you're watching us and you have a relationship that's struggling with religion, it's hard, but it's not impossible. Like, nothing is impossible for God either, so... Yeah. Um... When it comes to morals, I feel like we do. I feel like when it comes to family, that's important to both of us. And I feel like also, um, like, being polite, knowing who to res how to respect one another. How to show respect. How to show, respect, um, how to show humble, humbleness. Humbleness, be humble. Be always being humble, no matter who you come across with, mm -hmm. you know, um when it comes to values i feel like we have different type of values like i feel like we have different like priorities when it comes to values like for like for example me i feel like my first thing on the list for value would be my family i don't know for you it would be okay. my family and then second to me it would let's say for example it would be my work and I feel like for you, it's something else. I feel like for you would be probably like tus amistades or something. Like, I feel like you value certain things like that more. You? <laughs> I really do. Well, I mean, you're included with my family, obviously. Mm. But on a separate note, it's you more. Like, as a person, as you, because like you're my team. So mm -hmm. if my team is struggling, I'm struggling. So, that's why I was like, oh, got to pick it up for her. You know, help mm -hmm. her out. You know, that's why it's a big thing for me. So, yeah. So, we have different values. But, morals, I think we have the same. So, this answer would be, yes, for the most part, we've discussed uh, what's most, what's important to each other, to yeah. each of us. Ooh. I think it was sour. <laughs> Guys, I think it's pretty bomb. It's huge. Imagine the big one. Oh, yeah, and this was a small one. And they're like, oh, yeah, and I'm like, ah. No, but honestly, this is not really what I wanted to do. I, I, this is what I want to do, right, babe? I want to just go to, like, our grocery and just buy a bunch of fruit and just make, like, a fruit salad thing. But when, just a fruit, though. Like, nothing on it. And maybe mm -hmm. just limon and tahini on the side. Como botanear, you know, and, like, fruit. But then she goes, oh, it's come much. I was like, hmm. And I really didn't like it. And then when we called to see if it was open, the lady's like, oh, and we can do yogurt. I'm like, oh, I'll do yogurt instead of that. Like, that's why I like yogurt. Mm -hmm. And right now I'm full. 
And I'm sorry, excuse me. Pero como dijo Trek, it's better out than in, I always say. Right, babe? Mm -hmm. right. So next, okay. uh, number seven. It's date night. It's date night. But you, but you each want to see a different movie. How do you handle it? Mm. I feel like we both... We always want to watch almost the same movie. The yes. only times that it's very, it's different is when it's like a geeky movie. Like a Star Wars movie. Or pretty much just kind of Star Wars stuff related. Or, or super geeky stuff like Star Trek, stuff like that. Um, I know, I like Our both. movies... Or girl movies. But I end up going with you, though, with those ones. And it's not so much work because I like good stories. But the thing is, and she'll attest to it, for some reason, when I'm watching movies, I end up figuring out how the movie ends, right? Like, most of the time, yeah. where I figure stuff out, and, and I'm like, baby, and she goes, did you already, how do you know this guy? Watch, watch. And it happens, and she goes, why did you tell me? <laughs> so, it just ruins it for her. So, I tried to be quiet. Yes. Okay. So... I would say we keep looking until we find something we both want to see. Yeah. Pretty and much. That, and that's how we always do it. Same thing with restaurants. It's like, what should we, what do you want? Well, I want Chinese, I want this, I want that. What about you? I'm in the mood for this and that. And it's like, okay, we both kind of want this. Why don't, out of these kind of things, why don't we go here? Oh, you know, how about we go there? And it's like, oh, okay, you know what? Why not here? And it's like, oh, okay. And then when we're almost halfway there, we're like, oh, y si nos vamos para acá para este rumba, agarramos tacos y nos vamos. I los tacos siempre. Kind of, not really. <laughs> but yeah, that happens all the time. Mm -hmm. Okay, number eight. Do you show physical affection for one another in public? Mm, depends who we're around. I feel like we hardly do, though. In you. public. You. Me? I can't keep my hands off her. Yo, oh, really? You're always Edward. Stop. Or no, we're at the store. Hi, babe. I'm always on her. You, she doesn't really that much. But I she, don't. Not in public. Not in public. She doesn't like showing that. She doesn't like doing PDA too much. I mean, especially because there's people around, and you don't know what they're gonna judge. There are always judgmental people out there, so that's why I don't do it. And me, I D G A F. Mm -hmm. I think that's how you say. It. And I'm like Yolo. And I'm like, I-L-Y. Anyways. But I do it all the time. So it would be... Sure, sometimes holding hands and cuddling is natural for us. I wish that would be the best okay. one. Where are the other ones? No, we don't know each other well enough to be that close yet. It's early yet. But there is some physical contact when we're together. All the time, every chance we get, we can keep our hands over one another. Only mm. in my imagination. <laughs> Pretty much in my imagination. <laughs> but yeah, the first one you said. Mm -hmm. uh, and sorry guys, I have allergies right now too. Kind of, so does she. It's that time of the season. I probably you guys got them too. Number nine. We're getting close, guys. How many questions is it? I think it's ten. Oh. You see this person with an old flame of his or hers. How do you deal with it? Oh. So basically it's saying if you see your one another. With someone they used to date. or They, they used to date their ex or their, you know, someone that they had feelings for or a crush or whatever. How do you deal with it? If you see them together. I feel like. Mm, I cut you in the face. That's what I do. <laughs> I, I wouldn't say it's a little would, jealous, but I know we'll have a conversation about it soon. What's the other option? Other one is angry. This is unacceptable. I'm fine with it. He or she told me about it earlier and explained they would just be catching up. That's unacceptable. It doesn't bother me at all. Heartbroken, how could they? Probably heartbroken, how could they? For you? I should probably be angry. Angry? Yeah, I'd probably go really mad. Like, ah! I think I would get super mad at that point. Yeah, I think I would think angry to an acceptable, but not mm -hmm. heartbroken. Because I'll be like, why are they I'll be doing like, that? Fuck? And then when it's like, I don't know, the motherfucker just showed up. Like, oh, oh, huh? Because you won't be heartbroken. You still be pissed off. Like, motherfucker should be coming here. The person should be coming. Blah, blah, blah. Or people should be here, right? Mm -hmm. I say angry. Angry, obviously. 
cut you so, in the face. I can't. So, lo que queremos decir es que si lo veo a él con alguien que anduvo, era su novia, o quien, él anduvo antes, novio, o tuvo feelings, burro. a crush, uh, yo me voy, me voy a enojar. Pues, I'll be angry. A juego. Y a lo mejor lo corro otra Te vez. Te corto en la cara. <laughs> otra vez? Do you really? Really? You gonna go into that again? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Number 10. Hmm. Ta -da -da -da. Ha. Oh. You ha. Ha. <laughs> ha. <laughs> We're gonna edit to my beautiful goose. With ha. Okay, go. You have <gasps> to cancel plans with this person because you're sick. How does she or she react? One, he or she delivers chicken soup and a movie for us to watch. Um, hope you feel better soon. I get a call or text every couple of hours from him or her just to see how I'm doing. Or he or she was disappointed but made other plans when I was with friends. He or she was angry. I bailed. I want to see the text. What were the options? Let me see. Maybe the first one. I would go with. I spend the. I you would, would not deliver chicken soup to me. You would text me every. I want to say a couple of hours and be like, "How are you doing?" No, but like if it. But okay. So you're saying no. What I would do if it was you, I never done it. Or I go with you till two in the morning to the hospital and stay there with you. And when I have to work at seven the very next day, that that's not me just sending you text, is it? Okay. Right. Well, I don't know. I mean, if you feel like all I would do is text you. It's because that it's true when you're at work. Well, that's di okay. That's a little different. But again, if I could, I would. Oh my God. She always gets dirty. Always. <laughs> and it's always like <clears throat> right there too. Okay. But. So what? Well, so since we live together and we're married, I wouldn't say it would be the chicken soup then because you'll be there with me. Yeah, nonstop. Okay. <gasps> Results meant to be. Oh. We're meant to be. Babe. I'm just kidding. I knew it. Get away. I'm kidding. I knew we were. Since with two of you are meant to be together, this is a relationship worth working on. No matter how long you've been together, know you'll make a great couple as long as you both cherish one, one another. another. If you're looking, oh, <laughs> for another quiz <laughs> to further your intellect, please hit us at www. Quiz. So basically, com. guys, and we're not I'm lying. Saying, not. There's yeah. where it says. Let me see uh, if it focuses a little bit. Hold on. See, it says, um, are meant to be results. We're think. meant to be. Yeah. Tell una huera y un huero. Well, if you guys can see, it says, results are meant to be. So it seems that me and him are meant to be, obviously. We're here right now. Aquí ya estamos y no nos vamos. <laughs> Everything else was great. I really liked it. Um, I can't good. believe we're doing this this late because right after this, I'm pretty much going to sleep because I have to work tomorrow at 7 in the morning. I'll probably be <sighs> editing this video, guys. So Yeah, and I'll be snoring next to her. Yeah. <laughs> but um, it's okay. So basically, that was our day today. This is what we did. So. We woke up and stuff, and then, you know, work and stuff, and then we had to go look for the shoes, then went to our cuñadas, and then we came back here and ate this, and yeah, and we did the quiz. A little chill, just kind of our day for today, um, our Sunday for both of us. Yeah. Um, kind of thing. But yeah, no, I mean, other than that, it was a good day. Um, we promise we'll have a challenge video soon. We had one. But let's not speak of that. No we'll more. redo it. No, we'll redo. Try to redo it. I didn't. I want to redo it, but then I don't because then I feel like it'll lose like that whole. That it was just very. Uh, how can I say it? Just very out of the mind. It was very out of the blue, very improvised, but it came out really good for being improvised. And now if we redo it, I feel like we're trying to, you know, copy the old one, and it's gonna be forcing them maybe like the joke again to laugh at it when. The first time it just it was so natural because you weren't expecting and now you're like all right so this is when he kind of says this and it's like oh ha, 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 ha. and it's like nah, that's insane. 
you guys might still laugh, but deep down, I feel like I'll be giving you guys something hollow. Yeah, um, but we had fun today. I had real fun. We had fun. And I'm really um, tired, though. <laughs> remember to share as much as you guys can. Share, like, subscribe, hit the little doorbell thing somewhere around here. <laughs> Um, hit the, the like, the share, or it's over here, por aquí. No, son todas las cosas, pero yo veo que los del YouTube siempre les gusta apuntar y, oh, aquí tenemos esto en este link por acá. Y luego si la prensa es a la, la X ahí arriba en la esquinita, se borra todo. ¿Eh? But yeah, guys, um, thank you. Thank you for everything. liking, subscribing, viewing. Um, definitely share it. Give us ideas if you have something, your questions, comment. Again, Junior, seriously, bro. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, yeah, seriously, stop. But thank you for the So we're done for today. We'll be uploading more. Um, Hopefully soon. And we'll more. bring more stuff to the plate. Um, but yeah, pretty much, Lo guys. Que no que stuff in the plate. <clears throat> Alright, guys. Well, thank well, it was fun. Thank you for joining us for today. Hope you had fun. We had fun. We're hella tired. And hopefully we'll see you in a few days or if not next week with a challenge video. Bye. Thank you for watching, guys. Subscribe. Bye. Bye. Ah! Stop. Are Why are you doing that? Babe, it doesn't do anything. Why am I recording? <laughs> Why is she? This is so Stop. Look, it doesn't do anything. Robert, I'm okay. Look, like. Stop. It doesn't do. <laughs>